What's up guys, this is James First, and welcome back to more Let's Play Pokemon Crystal. Last time, we went through Victory Road and challenged Silver, who became, in our sense, a true rival. And we made it here to the Indigo Plateau. We did a couple adjustments to the team, and today, we're going to be fighting the Elite Four. Now, I do not recommend you go like this and mid to late 30s. I recommend you at least begin your early 40s before challenging the gym, but grinding takes a while, and I think we're going to be fine, so let's just go into it. Welcome to the Pokemon League, Ethan. How do you know my name? Allow me to introduce myself. I am Will. I have trained all around the world, making my psychic Pokemon powerful. And now at last, I have been accepted into the Pokemon, or the Elite Four. I can only keep getting better. Losing is not an option. Well, I am the protagonist, so of course you gotta lose to me. Will actually looks a lot more threatening than he actually is. He starts out with Zatu, he's a psychic user. Level 40 psychic type, psychic flying type actually, my bad. With the moves Quick Attack, Future Sight, Confuse Rate, and Psychic. Uh, Reaper and Maki are gonna do wonders in this gym because... Actually, now I'm looking at it, all my members could actually do quite a bit of damage to him. Since, yeah. Because I said so. Yeah, why not? Uh, Confuse right, damn it. And I think Reaper should be able to tank it. He is a pretty tanky Pokemon. Come on, no, don't hurt yourself. Should take it out, which is good since Zatu can really only do quick attack. That's it for that. Which one's gonna be next? Jinx. Okay, we're gonna switch that to Maki since Jinx is a Jinx is a part Ice type. Uh, like I said, Ice Psychic type, level 41 with the moves: Double Slap, Lovely Kiss, Ice Punch, and Psychic. So, Flame Wheel. And let's hopefully I'll knock it out in one hit. There are two Pokemon that I really want to use, or uh, er, that Maki's gonna be a good fit for. This is one of them. It didn't affect Maki. Hey, but because we're folk. <laughs> no, times have change. There we go, Jinx is down. And is it... I think it's gonna be Slowbro next, since he does have a Slowbro. Ball to to level 36, nice. I think I'll just keep the experience share on it for the uh, rest of the challenges, aside from the champion. Uh, Slowbro... You know what, let's give Cassie. This is gonna be Cassie's first battle, why not? Slowbro, I still like that animation, how the... Uh, the shelter on its tail and Slowbro actually look at each other like confused. Uh, Slowbro is a water psychic type level 41 with the moves. Curse, Amnesia, Body Slam, and Psychic. Uh, regarding Cassie's moveset, I think Cassie is really fine for the rest of the uh, journey with her moveset. There are some uh, moves I would like to have, but they're not until like the level 60s and I doubt we'll even reach that even after all the post game stuff and whatnot. So I think Cassie's fine for the most part. Until she like fully evolves, which is gonna be a well no a critical hit. Come on now. Fine. You could have uh... Volti, I guess. <laughs> Come on, Volti. Smile at it and make it faint. Uh let's see how much Sonic Boom is gonna do. I was originally going to get the uh, the move from the game corner in Golden Rod City for Volti, but after I saw how much it was going to be, because I'll be honest, I just buy the coins and then just get whatever I need. And yeah, that's going to be expensive. It's not going to be worth it at all. Okay. One more Sonic Boom should do it. Damn it, okay. Damn, this is so bro, you've been despite your goofy appearance, you've been actually kicking my ass. I 
I, like I said, I think I said the Slowpoke line was actually pretty good, and I, though I never used it before. But yeah, it's making me want to use it. Okay, let's just bite this thing. And that's it for that. Half his team is down. Lots of experience since we're not, uh, our Vaulty is down. Uh, why are you sending out the other Zati? You can't really attack me with this except for Confuse Ray and Quick Attack because those are its two moves. It also has a uh, Psychic and Future Psych. So yeah, really it could only Confuse me and Quick Attack me. I don't know why he sent this out, but eh, okay. I don't mind when the IA does weird things. Except for that. I am feeling kind of skittish because this, uh, because how this fight is going so far. I don't know if it's going to be a good moment for the rest of the uh, champion, or the rest of the elite foreign champions, so. Hopefully, I'll do good. And, oh, you finally used the max potion. How wonderful. How wonderful indeed. And you bit yourself? That ain't cool. Uh, I believe each Elite Four does have two Max Potions, so... Well, really, they rarely use them. I rarely see the Gym Leader use it. I think one Gym Leader used it, but that was it. And how many times can I say Gym Leader in a sentence? Probably more than you can count. Confuse Ray again? Come on, man. Okay... That's good. He's probably gonna use his last Max Potion. Or no, I might doubt it. Well, if I can hit, it will be good for the rest of the fight. Alright, there we go. Nice, nice, nice. There we go. Awesome, Reaper. Awesome, awesome. Honestly, I was kind of worried about Reaper using Umbreon since most of the dark moves, uh... Uh, appear in later generations, but hey, he's been holding his own in these battles, plus with that awesome defense. And last but not least is Exeggutor. Hmm, last time I saw you were a bit taller. Eh, maybe just a different place or whatnot. Exeggutor is a grass psychic type level 41 with the moves Reflect, Link Seed, Egg Bomb, and Psychic. Despite Eggbond sounding goofy as hell, it is actually pretty devastating. Or, kind of like, oh shit, it can actually do that? It can actually do that? I don't know, Will. Have you ever heard of Country Boy? <laughs> Alright, Flame Wheel again, and we should be good. And that's it for one... Or, one Elite Four member. I... I can't believe it! Even though I was defeated, I won't change my course. I will continue battling until I stand above all trainers. Now, Ethan, move on and experience the true ferocity of the Elite Four. Okay, so this is actually interesting. Uh, I kinda wanna talk about Will a little bit more while we, uh... While I, uh, revive my team members and heal them up. Uh, Will, actually, in the manga, is actually a bad guy. You don't see him until, more or less, the end of the... ...against the Johto arc. So, yeah, he also looks a lot more goofy and <laughs> ...being a villain than here, when he actually looks pretty... ...pretty scary, I'm not gonna lie. So, yeah, I don't really have much to say about... Did he ever appear in the anime? That's what I wanna know. Because I don't think he ever appeared in the anime, which is kind of crazy. I don't think any of- the, or no, two of these Elite Four members have appeared in the anime, at least in some capacity. So yeah, oh, I realize we only have like, quite a bit of hyper potions. I better do good for the rest of these fights, because, yeah, these fights can be tough if you don't know what you're doing. And since I'm going under level, just to try it myself, uh, I might have a weirdish time, so... Yeah, uh, for this one I want to have Maki out in front. 
Actually, no, let me have Cassie out. I'm trying to think for a sec. Whoa! I am Koga of the Elite Four. I live in the shadows, a ninja. My intricate style will confound and destroy you. Confusion, sleep, poison. Prepare to be a victim of my sinister technique. Whoa! Pokemon is not merely about brute force. You shall see soon enough. Koga is actually an Elite Four member this time. He was originally a gym leader. Which is really cool. I like when they do stuff like this. They introduce old cast members in higher positions and whatnot. It... We even saw that with Lance confirming to be the champion. Now. Alright, uh, I just think that's really cool. I like it when they do stuff like this. There you go, slow 40, bug poison that with the moves, double team, spiderweb, baton pass, and giga drain. He might be annoying because of that, uh double team, but I hope Cassie can take care of it, since I want Cassie to have at least some sort of win during these battles. Since even though it's not fully evolved, I... well, it can't really escape now, I didn't even know Spiderweb did that. At least some sort of win during these battles, which... already else is down, nice! Which one's gonna be next? Venomoth. Eh, let's go for it. Venomoth is a poison bug type. Yeah, I know it's flying, but it's a poison bug type. Level 41 with the moves Supersonic, Gust, Psychic, and Toxic. Be wary of Toxic because it does badly poison damage. I believe there's there's more of a difference between poison and badly poison. Badly poison does more over time. So be wary of that. Uh, I think I can take one more Psychic. Well, I did, and I think I'll have to switch out, because Cassie's not looking too high, and I don't want to race Moist or Revive on it, so... We're going to... Pelomota. Why not? And you can use Earthquake on it, because so, it's not flying type, and it doesn't have Levitate. Abilities weren't introduced in this game. It wasn't until Gen 3, I think, they were introduced, or Gen 4. I don't know, it's kind of weird to, uh... To think that Gen 3 doesn't have abilities, but I believe they do. And, oh no, not Supersonic. Okay, hit, yeah, nice. I think with these battles so far, Volti might actually catch up with us in due time. Yeah, just one level and it'll be on par with us, and I could put the pink bow back on it. Fortress! This thing is a... This thing specializes at being a wall. Level 30, 43, Bug Steel type with the moves. Protect, Swift, Explosion, and Spikes. Oh, I did not see Explosion there, so that's gonna be... A bit detrimental, but I think we should be fine. This thing is a pure wall as... Well, not with special defense, apparently. <laughs> that thing went down quick! Okay, then, what's next? Muck. Uh, we're gonna switch back... to Villarota. Muck! I did not think I would take down Fortress that quick. I thought I was gonna use Explosion or Spikes on me, since Spikes are... Yeah. Uh, level 42, Poison type with the moves. Minimize, Acid Armor, Sludge Bomb, and Toxic. While Muck does have some great stats, uh, I always thought it was more uh, viable in the anime since Ash used it. <laughs> Any Pokemon that Ash used in the anime, I wanted to use at some point, or with the main trio. Wow, Mudslap didn't do that much. Okay, how much is Poison or Sludge Bomb gonna do? We're having a pretty better time with Koga than Will and 
yeah, Volti's on par with us now. I don't really need to keep the experience share on it. Yeah, I'll keep it on, why not? Uh Crobat. Let's go with Stacy. Crobat is a poison flying type, level 40 44, I believe. Yeah, 44. With the moves Double Team, Quick Attack, Wing Attack, and Toxic. So this is why I have Ice Punch now, because super effective against flying types and other types that we might see during this uh, Elite Four and Champion Challenge. And, oh, Ice Fang didn't really do that much. Crap. Oh, come on, don't be toxic towards me. No, don't miss! Stacy's been missing quite a bit, and that's not good. Come on, Stacy. Come on, girl. You got this. This could be... yeah, it used Double Team way too many times. And, oh, it's getting it in a third time. No! This is not good. Oh, it hit! Nice! Can you freeze it? Please freeze it. No, you didn't freeze it. Well, Stacy did manage to do quite a bit of damage to it. Nah, Stacy's down. I thought I could have it, but... Uh, who stands a chance against Crobat? Uh, Reaper? How much is Shadow gonna do? I could always go with Volti and use uh, Self Destruct if push comes to shove, which I might have to. Yeah, this is not looking good at all. A full restore in Yellow Elf? How come Will didn't get a full restore? What, is he, uh... Is he lame to y'all? I don't know. I don't know, Reaper. Reaper, come on, boy. Come on, boy. I think at this point... Uh, how much is Phantom gonna do? It's not gonna do that much, right? Yeah, barely any. And I don't have Toxic. You can't even get it now. Yeah, Quick Attack doesn't really do that much. I think we're about to be down here. Yeah, uh, this is Crow, but I didn't think it'd be this annoying. Yeah, let's do it. Please do a lot. did quite a lot, but... Uh... Come on, Maki, you gotta deal with this guy. You got this girl, come on. Okay, it hits. And yes, alright! Wow, worth this critical hit. You can use that for Bolty. But Koga's defeated. Ah, you have proven your worth. I subjected you to everything I could muster. But my efforts failed. I must hone my skills. Go on to the next room and put your abilities to the test. Next room's gonna be quite interesting. Alright, let me head on my team. Now that I think about it, Koga did more than to me than Will did to me. Uh, I have Volti uh, at half health because I might have to use it for self destruct for this next battle. And I forgot to heal the full heal. Uh, good thing we have quite a bit. Where are my full heals? There should be somewhere here. Yeah, there we go. And like with Koga. have another familiar face, which we're going to take on next time. So, next time let's play Pokemon Crystal, 
We'll take down this familiar face and up who's up ahead, alright? I'll see you guys in.